Water filling the halls of a Fall River High School and cascading down the stairs, forcing officials to call off class. All of this after a pipe burst overnight at Durfee High School. Good afternoon. I'm Chris McKinnon. And I'm Kate Merrill. Thanks for joining us. Students now have an unexpected day off as officials look to clean up the mess. But now the superintendent says this wasn't because of the weather. WBZ's Lisa Greshi reports now from Fall River. It was a last minute call to cancel school here at Durfee High School in Fall River. A call that caught some students off guard as they were dropped off to school anyway. And now the race is on to clean up the water. The stairs looked more like a waterfall at Durfee High School. The inside of the school didn't look much better after a pipe burst overnight. Initial reports coming in around 3 this morning. Fall River's District Fire Chief James Mellon says there was a break in a six inch standpipe on the school's top floor. It was a six inch standpipe. It's been putting thousands of gallons a minute out. The immediate task was shutting off the water, but because of how old the high school is, it wasn't easy. It took us a little while to figure out it's very old piping where the shutoffs were. Pictures from Superintendent Matthew Malone show the inside hallways covered in water. The wing of the school affected includes science classrooms and kitchens. How much water leaked? It's hard to say, but unfortunately, this will be no easy cleanup. I would conservatively estimate 30,000 gallons easily have leaked out through the building. Several water pumps could be seen on school grounds this morning, but there is no word on how long this cleanup will take or exactly how much damage was done. Once the water is gone, school officials say a damage assessment will tell when students can expect to come back to class. Reporting in Fall River, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.